Now that the games are over, it's going to take a little time to calculate how much visitors spent in Minnesota. But the House Committee has an idea of what to expect. It commissioned a report that said the final four will bring in $142 million. So let's break that down. What is the economic impact of the final four? That's a good question for Heather Brown. <laughs> what do you think of our fine city? I love it. Super clean. We all do a great job with the rail system. It's absolutely gorgeous. We've enjoyed all of our time here. There are a few things. We went to the Union restaurant and ate on the rooftop yesterday. That was fantastic. Meet Minneapolis. I think the people are so welcoming. Likes to hear more. Well, we found a great little pizza place right off of 5th, and we ate there like three times. Anecdotally, a lot of them want to come back at, a, at, at another time. We did find that out from the Super Bowl. Where 83% said they'd make a return trip, according to Meet Minneapolis's president and CEO. We we think that those statistics will, will bear out for, this, uh, for the final four as well. And that's hard to buy. <laughs> yes, that's exactly right. But those numbers aren't even included in the $142 million estimate. That adds up how much the 94,000 out of towners are expected to spend on hotels, shopping, food, rental cars, and ride shares. This is four nights in a hotel. Mm -hmm. How many restaurants do you think you've gone to? <laughs> We've been eating like crazy. So that's great in and of itself, but where we're really excited about it is that it opens the door for us to go after even more events. Tenant says 70 big potentials are in town right now to see how Minneapolis handles big events. It's a prime sales opportunity for us, and that's the real value. Because other groups that aren't even connected come in and kind of check us out? Absolutely. Huh. People that well, we were not even on their radar. And might want to come back. We are foodies, yeah. so we love to eat our way through big cities. <laughs> Heather Brown. And I think we have a lot left to eat here. WCCO 4 News.